welcome back to our channel today. This is exciting, this, isn't it? Well, it's a bit exciting for us, anyway. We went and did a little Christmas shopping. We went to B&M, mm -hmm. The Range, mm -hmm. and Dunelm. Mm -hmm. mm. mm. So we thought we'd show you what we have. Um, cool. First thing, we only got one thing in Dunelm. So we'll show you that first. Look at this little beauty. He's just fabulous. Sandy Claus is coming to town. This is a death killer. It, you did, you scratched yourself on that, didn't you? I started bleeding, it really hurt. Oh. Bad. Bad Sandy. He has blue eyeshadow on as well, so. Well, he is just gorgeous. He fits. So he nice. has very stunning jumper on. Little fur gilet. I think it's super cool. You don't really see them in pink, pink, do you? It looks like Tinkerbell's shoes. I know. I, I, do you know, I would love a pair of shoes like this. He has like so many pairs of slippers on. Well, he ended up costing... £25. He was, it was £25. £25.99. I love him. I just love him. But yeah, he was around £25 and he's his little sack and his little head. I think I might just leave him out all year because I, I just, I love him. I thought have like a bull boy. Oh, well, oh, like a So there's Santa Claus. Okay, so next we're to the range. Because then, the range was fun. <laughs> then I can show you this little fella. <laughs> we didn't get that on that day. You got that on a different day, didn't you? I did, it's day <laughs> well. He's so cool. <laughs> He's got a little spring. Here's a thing. fun fact about this little guy. Um, our elves from last year, we have four, and um, they stayed and they've actually started moving for some awkward reason. And he was in this little guy's arms, an elf on the shelf. They're actually just over there. I wondered why his arms were like this. I know. Yeah, because he's, he's so super cool. Like he's the colours of our living room, same as the Santa Claus. And he's got all these springs, and I can go like this. If you I have an him. idea for our living room, because the theme is pink, white and grey, uh, if you have an idea, comment down below. Well, he was £22.99. Then he had a couple, but I had to get him. And there were just plain white ones and gold ones. There is a plain white, I believe, wasn't there? I think there's some gold ones. I just, I just love him. And again, I think he's going to stick around for the whole year as well. Yeah, so for all year Christmas. Fabulous. Don't forget right. to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell to no be notified when we put another video on. Naturally. Okay, so this year we have a big artificial tree, a big green one, and we've had it for years. And the girls wanted a white tree. We've got so it just we've, we've, we've bought a white Christmas tree. So I thought we'd keep the green tree in our hallway and our traditional colours. And in here we'll go with the pinks and the greys. So I managed to get these Christmas lights. Pink and white? They're pink and white. I'm still a bit <coughs> optimistic. I don't want them to be like fuchsia pink. I think they're in B&M then ones. No, you wouldn't no like I've got these in the range. A big oh. one called Pink. I pink. cannot actually remember how much it was, unless I find the receipt in it. I do. I well, how much were they? I think they're 15 or 17 or something like that. Yeah, there was around just under Teens. 20 pounds, weren't they? There was 600 and they're indoor or outdoor use. So once the tree is up, we will show you because I'm not quite sure. You must see in all our you must helping. see in all our videos when we're in the kitchen uh, that we have Christmas lights, but it's like not we have Christmas, Christmas lights, lights all year round, don't we? Mm -hmm. All across the kitchen ceiling. Okay, so the next thing I bought is this roll of like glittery ribbon. They were three twenty nine. My plan is because I've got a large reef type thing. In a Mickey head? Let's no, just no, call no, it a reef rope. Reef rope. Oh. Yeah, I want to put it down the stairs so I've got some of this to kind of entwine it into it. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it, but I have an idea in my head. So this and you have perfect. Mickey I have a massive Mickey Mouse reef that I made We're going to see that years ago. When did we get that, the reef rope? That was in the range. I think it was about... 10, 10, 11 pounds? Yeah, so it's I think it's big, isn't it? It's big. It's bushy. Okay, so we've got some new decorations from here. All the our pink theme. So we have this little velvet reindeer. We've got He's so cute. cute. Little star. 
It's really sweet. It's soft and then. And it was $1.99. Oh, they've got this whole range of pink and white decorations at the minute, and they're just so pretty. I see one that I like. You see one that you like? Oh. I know, little angel. She's so pretty. She's in pink and grey, and she was one ninety nine. So she can hang. I suppose you could hang her from the tree or just stand her somewhere. She's just. I know. Isn't it pretty? <laughs> this was one pound. A pound. A little polar bear with a pink scarf. He's going to be here all year round. Let's him. show them how cute he is. He's so super sweet. I thought he's only a pound. I can hang him in the tree. We love Christmas, don't we? I need all my Christmas shopping as well. I'm really good. You got nearly all my presents. <gasps> Okay, so we have, oh, it's got a little dig on it then. That's okay, we won't put it that side. A little pink unicorn. I hear the ice cream truck. And this is because Harry loves unicorns, so we get If stuff. you go to my school or you know me, then you're gonna know why we're just this. the unicorn queen. Okay, and he was one ninety nine. A sparkly unicorn. Or she. Or she, to be fair. Probably a she because it's pink. This is cute. Yeah, I'm not quite sure where I'm going to put this. I might hang it from up here or something. What's but it's, this says? It's just a little hangy thing. It's so funny. <laughs> hangy thing. But it's quite long and it's got little fur stars and little wooden so snowflakes funny. and bells. If I just thought it was really pretty. It. And that was only two seventy nine. Oh, so but the range has got some really good bits at the minute, which I think are a bargain. Because sometimes Christmas decorations are really expensive. Shall we move on to b &M? I think they're really expensive. Is there anything else from the range while we're doing that? I don't think there is. Mm -hmm. them no, back in there. Okay. So then we went to b &M, didn't we? Mm -hmm. Now, first thing, I saw this. And it reminded me of a basket that I saw on the White Company website, which was pretty expensive, it was about 90 pounds. Oh my god. And I just, I think it was obviously a little bit bigger than this, but I just liked it. And these were only four pounds in b and I'm not even sure where it's gonna go, but I liked it. We could not Christmassy, but I like it. We could put, um, oh, we could put like tinsel in it and like make it like. I could put you in it with tinsel on you. I'm pretty sure I will fit in that. I'm not gonna try. Just maybe go like this for the rest of the video. So, next thing, we just got some random sellotape because we always need sellotape, and there's four rolls there for a pound. Here, yeah, actually, give me that. And I can put it on there. Then we saw this. It is so cute. It's a little Santa plate. You've got Santa there, you've got a little Robin. And reindeer and snowman and then it says it's Christmas. What about the angel? And they were only two forty nine. We took we both took the label off, but yeah, they were two forty nine. I thought just for Christmas, put some cookies on or mince pie. I just thought it was really cute. Santa, you could put some milk in there. You, you certainly could. So this was one pound. Um, the there's a little ribbon there. Um, and I'm pretty sure there's going to be a hole in here somewhere, or you make a hole, and you There'll can. There'll be a hole. And you put them on Christmas presents uh, for like, if you're going to write um, two so-and-so from them. What do you mean? Well, we wanted gold because, well, what I can show you now, we've got wrapping paper in now. And to match the sort of the theme of the room, we've got this pink and it's got like these geometric gold trees on it. And it's 12 metres for a pound, which I thought was absolutely brilliant. Bargain. So the gold labels will match them. And these were only one pound. Yeah, it's really good. So it's like Bye. 36 metres for three pound. That probably do all the Such a bargain. Okay, I've got a couple of gift boxes and there's a, a little something I want to do. I can't really say too much because I know she'll watch, but my two older girls, I wanted to make them these little Christmassy boxes. So I got these and these were two pounds each. And they are going to be absolutely perfect. You can just put in the caption, Lauren's on, don't watch. Well, 
go for Lara, clearly. Mm. And green Pizzelli. Definitely green Pizzelli. But it's, got, it's got a gold green. lid, so it'll still match. With the gold lid, even. Gold. Excellent. And they were one pound. Okay, pound. what's next to you? These are... Oh, these are so beautiful. Stocking. Okay. There were sacks as well, but they didn't have a B in it. They, so yeah, the sacks were just fabulous. So I think they were about six pounds each, but they didn't have... A B in it, so I didn't get another B. And I won't get one without the other. So we got an oh, H for Harriet and a B for Bo. And they're really soft, really fluffy. Oh, they're just beautiful. Oh, the Mickey ones that they were Quite old now, are they? Well, these are only three pounds each, and I just thought they were just really pretty. Mm. Shame we didn't have these in the pink, actually. But they are, they're absolutely gorgeous. I've been meaning to ask you this, Mum. I mm. want to do a, a video of making our Elves on the Shelves um, stockings, so that will probably be our next video. Okay. This is Lauren Zoe's Christmas presents. They're just little stocking fillers. I don't I'll know where you did get the watch. These, they're little just um, hot chocolate sets with whisk. marshmallows, a little whisk. And the idea is, is to take them out of the packet and I'm going to put them really nicely in the gift box. No, keep it in the thing. Can I draw them? I did give it in the thing. Well, I'll show them when I've done it and I bet they say, oh, no, Dad, that's really good. Really good. These were five pounds each. Nice big mug as well. You get me one of them, They didn't have many of these. There wasn't that many. Oh, I like from. this one more. Well, there was three of that one and one of this one. So I've got them different ones. So that's probably Dougie's because it's green. But yeah, both five pounds each. The whisk. same little whisk and giant. Cool. Yeah, I just I like them. I think they're nice. And then oh, Zoe and Laura love these. These are tea tree face wash foaming. Face wash. Foamy face so, wash, yeah. So you push it down and it comes out in a big ball. Yeah, I love that. But they use this a lot. And I didn't realise they had this in B&M, to be fair. It was uh, Bo who actually saw them. How much were they, Bo? 89p. 89p. I Looking swear they pay more than that for these. So they would just go in their stocking. There's like a, you're going to put it to like five or six pounds. I'm not sure how much they are, because like I said, I don't really buy Did it. Did we get so. this from B&M? Yeah, a new spice. I was going to when she bought it then. Uh, it's <laughs> fabulous actually. It's the new Febreze M is spiced apple. I think it was about one pound fifty and it smells amazing. Absolutely spectacular. And I have actually got this at the minute because I was just thinking it smells spectacular. I've got this, um, I've got it in Home Sense. It's the apple honey butter. You already candle. showed that one. Oh my oh, god, no. get this candle. It is unreal. And there's that another one you should get. It's a um, tobacco scented one. That's oh, the really warm good. tobacco pipe from Home Sense. Really nice. It just, it's a really nice, I don't know, nice homely, warm. And what did you say it smell like? I forgot. Oh, it's, it's warm tobacco pipe, so it's like got a, a, an underlying cigar smell. It's weird to explain because you wouldn't think smoking smells oh, good, but it is really, really nice. I think, I think these were about five ninety nine each in Home Sense. So shall I go get this? Oh yeah. I'll be back in a sec. You gonna put it on her? <laughs> so blue tack as well. I'm not quite sure why every single time I go to B and M, I buy blue tack. I don't ever pick it up, but I always seem to pay for it and have it in the bag. So one of these keep buying blue tack. Who knows? I think it's about pounds, was it, Bo? Yeah. Something like that. Ah. The next thing is, I got this, it's a vacuum bottle. I think, oh yeah, four pounds. And it's got all little doggies on it. It's really nice, actually. It feels really nice quality. Proper vacuum flask. And I got this for my, for my cousin's boyfriend because I just wanted to. Okay, this is the other thing that we bought. We bought a Christmas jumper for Belle Belle. She's never worn a jumper before, have you? But for some reason, she just gets majorly overexcited to wear the jumper. You pick it up, she goes mad. So she's happy. I think that was about four pounds, wasn't it, the jumper? Is it right? What do you think, Belle? Tell everyone how you feel about your jumper. I love it, it's a 
but she looks super cute and she gets cold. She may be fluffy, but did you buy some matches? She gets cold. She looks like an Ewok, so pretty to her. Just got some matches, can't remember how much they were, but that's quite heavy. Probably not a pound. And this, okay. This, it was five pounds and it's a candle and match gift set. So there's two candles in it and a box of matches. And this is gonna sound really silly, but I've been looking for pink headed matches in a jar. I can't find them anywhere. I have literally looked everywhere. So I saw this and I thought, oh, excellent. I'll just, I only wanted the matches. But then I thought, well, there are two candles there. I could put them in the girls' Christmas Eve boxes with their hot chocolate mugs. So I'll just take it all apart and I'll just keep the matches. That dog's so daft. Stupid dog. Okay, is that everything in that yeah, bag? Yeah, I put the receipt up there. Oh, you put the receipt up there. Was there something that we said, if I find the receipt? Yeah, you s Oh, that was to the um, plate, I think. When did I buy papaya scented tea lights? I, I don't know, but you did. This isn't even the right receipt. This is like <laughs> from Poundland. Where did this even come from? It was in the bag. The bag is a Poundland. Three tier plate rack. In the summer, I bought that plate wrap in the summer in Poundland. Where did this? Oh, sure it was. I had to use the B and M bag the other day, so I put everything in that bag. But that must have just been left in there from Poundland. Okay, one it's minute. all under the chair. Anyway, is there some under the chair? Do you want to go and put Bill over there, and then you can help me? No, put on the sofa. No. Okay, so to match the Hurry. golden pink theme, I got oh, no. some bows. There's matte ones and shiny ones. There was 15 in there and some ribbon, and they were £1.50 each. Bargain. Then to go with our white tree, we thought, well, what have we got to go on top? And we see these. They do them in silver or gold, and they're £6.99. And I suppose it's to your taste. One of my daughters loved it, the other one hated it. Um, but it's a tree topper, and I just thought it would just fit the theme of that tree. So he says, white is not a traditional Christmas colour. Neither is anything blingy. Oh well. So we have two trees. Oh well. One that Zoe likes, one that Laura likes. That's the way it is. Right, madam, I need to get under that chair. Where are we? Okay, Halloween coming up. We did pick up some Halloween bits. So first off, we have this little grey, pink and white ghosty trick or treat Halloween bowl. How much were they by? Pound. Pound. Um, may I add, these, would you think were you may not. gummies, but they're lollipops. They are zombie finger lollipops. And Bill's double was and four pounds. One, two, three, there's four in there, and they were a pound. <laughs> and here we have pick and mix, eight different sweets. It's it's a little jelly sweets, really. There's mushrooms. tea, mushrooms, cola bottles, you know, the usual. Ice creams. Yeah, Cherries. little ice creams. You've had it open when I said don't open it because proof there is a sweet <laughs> stuck in the lid. Harry. It is squished. Can you see that? It is squished in the Belle, lid. Belle, what did you eat? Did you already open the sweets when I said don't open the sweets, Harriet? Belle done it. Is it you? Is it you? Did you open the sweets? Maybe I did. Okay, so the next thing we have got Ghostbusters. What are they? Individually wrapped it's Ghostbusters slime chocolate marshmallow. Oh, like, like the marshmallow treats. Like green ones. I'm going to eat that after the video. Actually, I really cake. like these. My granddad um, used tea to. Cakes? Yeah, the tea cakes. But you know the ones, not when they're just in a packet, they were wrapped. Or in yeah, they're the Minaldi. I can't remember the name of them. I they're channels. Tea cakes. Tea cakes. Is there? Oh, they were just fabulous. The My granddad just put one on a little plate for me and used to come up in the morning. Oh. Look at this. Okay. Things. I don't know who's weirder, you for doing it or her for going along with mm -hmm. it. Okay, is that everything? Because we did put stuff over there. Oh no, there's one more thing. I got this plant in BM and it's. It's felt, I think, like a hardish kind of felt, and it's got a solid, like sand base. And this one. I just think it looked really cool. That's what Poundland the other one. This was 
about four or five pounds. It just looks really nice over on my unit. And yeah, we got this one. Oh, it was pound land, three oh. pounds. A little succulent, obviously not real. And it's got like a stone base. I just wanted to get some artificial plants because normal plants don't seem to last very long in here. Um, yeah. Hence the peonies over here we've had Mom for like said two it. years. Maybe three? We've had them years. Just give them a quick wash under the tap, they look fun. <laughs> they were actually Okay, that is it. <laughs> that is our little Christmas haul so far. I'm gonna make them so little far. boxes and let you know how they go. So far, not so far. <laughs> You're on the sofa, I am on the bench. In fact, actually, I don't know if you can see this. Oh, you're sitting on it. I don't know if you can see it. Can you see yeah, it? Jump on the net. Can you see what I'm sitting on here? Can you see that? Bo, look in the camera. Can you see my yes, I can see it. fabulous little bench here? I got this. Well, no, I didn't get this. My eldest daughter bought me this a couple of weeks ago in Home Sense. It was £99. And she said, there you go, Mummy. Early Christmas £99. Present. £99. So £100. £100. That's quite cheap. Oh I think God. it's a bargain. I am so over the moon with my little bench. Bell was even £99. Yeah, Bell was for a lot of money. Um, <laughs> I love it. So Thank, Thank you, you Robbie. So my money. beautiful You're an expensive seat. Buggy. <laughs> it's really cool. Anyway, thank you very much for joining us today on our little haul video. And Bell, naturally. Don't forget to like and subscribe and hit the notification bell to be notified when we pick another video up. High five. She actually has a bell. High five. <laughs> <laughs> she made you look really stupid. I'm gonna do that one day, and I'm gonna video on it. I'm gonna. She do does it. do it. To be fair, give me five. Straight after this video, I'm gonna video. I'm gonna go get a treat for her. Hold on. Give me five. Hold her. I'm gonna go get a treat for her. She will do it. Oh. She might do it. She might not. How has this video lasted three minutes longer than by the time you finished? It's Belle, you know, she just, she has a lot to say to the community. In fact, she told me she would like to start making her own videos. By the way, anyone, Belle is a cabotom. From her Instagram. She is, um, Two years old. She, as the vet said, is the biggest diva she has ever come across. She put flea drops on the back of her neck last year and Belle screamed the entire place down. Who did? Belle, when she had her flea drops. Oh, not even an good. injection. She's just mummy's princess and. I found mum. So much mm -hmm. Delicious. Hey, Belle. See you treat. High five. High five. Yay! Good girl. Anyway, so for me, five. Harry. High five. Bo, who's over there playing on her phone. <laughs> and from little Bill, bye bye. Don't forget, like and subscribe because we could really do with some new followers, really, couldn't we? But we Follow her Instagram. We love the ones we have as yeah, well. Yeah, go follow her, her Instagram. What's it called? Bell? What's Belle's Instagram? Bell dot the dot cabbage. Bell Bell dot the dot the cabbage. Say goodbye. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye.